Hey there, sports fans. I'm Marius Roman. And I'm Eugene DeHilly, and this is another presentation of Red Sea TV's R&D Sports Show. Show. Thanks Thank for you tuning guys. in again. Once more, Appreciate we it. are back. Uh, yes, sir. We are back today for our special topic show that we have once a week. Um, and we're going to get into a special topic that has been on the news, it's been on the sports channel, it's been all over the place. Uh, it is the, the video that we've been seeing left and right of Mike Rice. Doing um, some of this. That's right, <laughs> unbelievable. Uh, the Rutgers uh, University coach up in New Jersey, um, apparently one of the coaches was let go and he compiled like uh, so much a video, video of yeah, him doing all this of him stuff. doing all the stuff. Apparently, uh, he didn't know it was being videotaped or what. But some of the stuff is just, so it's just I amazing. Mean, it, this is way over the line. Way over. Way over. I'm, but I'm surprised it took so long to, to fire him out. because right. this they knew about it. Uh, yeah, I mean, right. in the December, I believe it was. That's right. And they and suspended him. They suspended him, but yeah. they didn't fire him. But I guess they didn't know that the video existed at the time. That's right. And then now that it's surfaced and yeah. it's, everybody knows about it. That, yeah. that they had to get rid of them. I mean, they, I mean, come on, you can't go around mm -hmm. kicking players, right? Throwing balls at their head, um, you know, verbal abuse like right. none other. Right. I mean, these these players, they're they're human beings. They're they're, right. they're boys, and I mean, they're they're young, young men, they're young, young men, men, right? Young mm -hmm. men, you know, you don't you don't got to treat them like that. That's right. I mean, he was he was fined fifty thousand dollars for doing that last year. So at that point, he thought, okay, I did my, my I paid my fine, I did my you know suspension. It's back to business. Just keep doing it, right? Well, I mean, obviously, he kept doing it. He didn't learn from that. I mean, it's just, it's in him. He has some really big anger management issues. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> he did apologize, but, you know, That's they not fired gonna cut him. It. That's He's not going to cut it. Yeah. Uh, maybe he'll get some uh, some chance down the road to redeem himself, but it's not going to be anytime soon. That's right. That video is very damning to, to his career right now. That's right. I mean, I just, I just don't see a human being do that to somebody. Right. But I guess, look around, you can see... Uh, the guy from Indiana, uh, oh my God, I can't believe I forgot his Bobby name. Knight. Right now. Bobby Knight. That's right. <laughs> Bobby Knight throwing chairs and stuff. So I mean, it's happened in college before. That's right. And, you know, or choking of players, or yeah. putting them in sheds out in the sun. But old school coaches. Old school <laughs> coaches. But this guy's a young not, coach. Yeah, Mike Rice, the young exactly. coach. Exactly. His dad is actually the uh, announcer for the Blazers back in Portland. So wow. kind of hits close to home for me. But uh, it's just. See, I can't, I I can't imagine putting myself in the minds of these young men that are going there. They know they're on scholarship, so they know that they're there to go to school because they're playing basketball for the school. Yeah. So if, if they're going through all this, they're thinking, man, if I say something, if I yeah, that, that's you know, make an issue, me. I'm going to get kicked out or something's going to happen. I'm not going to be able to play you know, ball and go to school anymore. That's what surprised me. I, in all that video, I didn't see nobody trying to retaliate, you know, like, right. you know, after he got hit in the or head or back, kick or you know? try to throw the ball back at right. him. Because that's right. what, like you were saying, that's their mentality. You know, if I do anything to, you know, defend myself, right. I'm going to get kicked off the team, no playing time. That's right. You know, yeah. my scholarship's going to be taken away, so. Parents going to get let down or whatever, you know. Yeah. But there's just so much pressure on these young men nowadays to go to school uh, and to perform. Um, you know, we're hearing so many other stories now, even from the Auburn, you know, oh, yeah, situation. Again, you know, changing grades. Changing grades and all that. I mean, there's so players. much pressure on, on these young men to perform and go to school. So they're going to do their part. They're going to be very submissive. They're going to do what their coach tells them to do because they trust in the, in the coach and his system. That's true. That's true. And uh, But this coming from an authority figure. You don't expect that from an authority figure. I can see it being a actually a player on the team maybe, right. you know, doing stuff like that. But coming from a coach, and what I'm surprised is, None of the assistant coaches said anything, did anything. Right. None of the managers. I mean, come on, these guys got to well, step up. They did when he they left. That's the problem. Yeah, but that's the thing. That's, that's right. too late. That's right. That's you right. know, that's too late. I mean, you got to stand up when you see it happening. That's you right. got to. At first, you know, first time it happens, take the coach aside and tell him, that's "Hey, right. you know, this is going on." But as soon as you see that instance after instance after instance happening, right, you got to step up. You know, speak up. I know you might say, "Oh, but I'll be threatening my job or right. something like that." Hey. You got to live up to you know higher standards. You know there you're you in go. college, you're playing college ball. Live up to the standards, you know of uh, respect, you know of human right. dignity. Basically, it is. I mean, to go around kicking people, <laughs> I mean, kicking people, throwing balls at their heads. That's, that's, that's an amazing story right now, guys. We're gonna leave you with the video at the end of this. You can kind of yeah, see what we're talking and about. Watch it and for yourself. Unbelievable. I mean, if, and let us know. Go to our Facebook site, www.facebook.com slash RD Sports Show. Give us feedback on that. Uh, or you might have already seen it on television. Uh, I know ESPN's, uh, you know, over the uh, 
uh, over the lines. I think is the show, right? Over the lines. Yeah, over the lines. Over yeah. the over lines. lines. They're the ones that first came out with uh, with this uh, video and all that. But uh, go see it, guys, um, or watch it here. Let us know what you think. Give us feedback on, on our show as well. Uh, if there's a particular topic that is so dear to you, let us know. We'd like to talk about it and see what you think. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Well, we appreciate your time today. I'm Marius Roman. I'm Eugene Hillian. And this has been another presentation of R&D Sports Show on Red Sea TV. That's right. Thank you, guys. Thank you.